Well, the superintendent of the Beaumont Independent School District says COVID-19 is forcing the district to reconsider everything this upcoming school year, including how to care for children with special needs. Fox 4's Rocio De La Fe reports on the options parents will have. Come August 17th, the return to school won't look like this. Instead, students and teachers will continue remote learning for at least the first few weeks. When it comes to special education, Beaumont ISD Superintendent Dr. Shannon Allen says students and parents will have options. Parents are going to have that flexibility to determine whether or not they want to continue services on campus face to face with safety protocols in place. Online instruction will also be available for the school year. But they're still not confident and they want to maintain uh, virtual learning. They will have the opportunity to do so. Dr. Allen agrees that direct personal and one on one contact between teacher and student is critical with helping special education students grow and develop. But she says it is up to parents to decide what's right for their child. We know that our students uh, Health and safety is priority for their parents and it is a priority for us. The new school year is not yet set in stone. Dr. Allen says there's still so much that's unknown. There are so many flexibilities and so many contingencies and we're trying our best to plan for everything that we possibly can plan for. When school does return online or in person, Dr. Allen says the district will work as a team. We do what we do because of kids and when you can really see your kids, and, and know that we're making that difference. I think that goes a long way toward, you know, motivating our team. To ensure all students get the education they need. In Beaumont, Rocio De La Fe, Fox 4, working for you. The district is polling teachers about instructional preferences, and as coronavirus cases surge, they will keep an eye on back-to-school registration.